This Hurricane Ian survivor and his family are being evicted from their FEMA provided trailer in Inglewood because they can't afford to pay the rent. I'm Fox 4 Charlotte County Community Correspondent Alex Orenchuk and the family tells me without other affordable housing options, they'll have no choice but to be homeless for the time being. Packing his family's belongings into a moving truck, Pedro Perez tells me his landlord, the Federal Emergency Management Agency, is evicting them from the property. FEMA basically told us that if we're not out by August 1st, um, we were going to be in, uh, hit with a $6,000 fine per month for every month that we stay in the trailers. Perez and his family moved into the trailers last August and lived there for free as part of FEMA's Hurricane Ian disaster relief housing because Perez's house was destroyed in the storm. Then in April, FEMA started charging rent, which he couldn't afford to pay. Uh, the amount that they imposed upon us was greater than what we could afford. Uh, we appealed that amount. Uh, they reduced it by a few dollars, not much, and we still could not afford it. Now Perez, an Army veteran, and his fiance, an Air Force veteran, and their three children have nowhere else to go. Our plan is to put all of our stuff into a storage unit, and uh, we're going to pitch a tent. Perez told me he's tried to find other housing options, but according to Zillow, the average price in Charlotte County for a four-bedroom rental is more than $2,300 a month. That's more than what FEMA is charging, and Perez says he can't afford it. It's either I feed my children or I pay their rent. I called Charlotte County Veteran Services and my contact with the disabled American veterans to try and get Perez and his family some help. I'll keep you updated on the search. In Inglewood, Alex Orenchuk, Fox 4.